What state do you live in? Louisiana. Louisiana? Louisiana. And what city? City of Plaquemine. Plaquemine? Plaquemine. And um, you're, you, are you retired? I'm retired. You're retired. And um, what did, where did you work and what did you do before you retired? I'm trying to parish in a school in Plaquemine. A uh, school of about 250 families, students in school. I was a coach for the athletic program. I was a moderator for the industrial functions. I uh, taught between reading class. I also uh, counseled many students and parents in school. I did school like the parents work. It is I brought people to God, 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 God. I remember that it was a very devastating tragedy in our country. I remember the power of the wind, the rain, the water coming up. I remember very vividly the amount of gusts of wind. I remember the sights of the people with the rest of the acts. Uh, many of them panicking. Some of them uh, literally taking advantage of the situation to harm other people, to their own benefit. I worked at Bethel State College on the Daily Arts and Sciences there. For, four, for the last four years before I retired. Um, I knew I had to retire when I, I, I was on campus early one day. I went in the restroom, it was like 6 in the morning, I was coming to work early. I went in the restroom, I had these restrooms already turned right and left to get in. Um, I, was, I couldn't get out of the restroom, I couldn't make a left turn, right turn. My body, my body wouldn't let me do it. So I stayed there for I was there. I stayed there for a week or that my pills kit had kicked in so finally get up my hands didn't crawl out. When I talk I hear some noise back, I hear feedback. Mm -hmm. A bunch of people. Um, Does this sound any louder to you than I ever talk? Yeah. And clear. Do well I taught anthropology for thirty years. Anthropology? Yeah. Very. Yeah. It impacted by this is my voice got worse. I Friday, actually, uh, I was just worried the deed's office. So I was assistant deed for about six weeks when the deed became the VP. So I became the deed for about four years, and that was sort of interesting. But what it did it was force me to. I said at that time I was I was thinking of retiring from deedship, going back to teaching. That's so when my voice got worse. So he said, I really couldn't teach any longer, so I just decided to retire. They couldn't hear me. Yes. I have one daughter. <clears throat> She's married. This is about a mile from us. She has three kids. The old one was about five, and the twins were just about 14, 15 months. How did and what's happening is now, it's 10 o'clock, it's somewhere right next to us. Um, my wife's not over here, but I have to finish yesterday down as soon as we finish up. Uh, and uh, so, um, my wife, my wife has to be managing every two hours from the day, so it's pretty hard to keep up with me. And uh, I don't know if you've read the most recent part, article on on um, Parkinson's disease from People magazine. Michael Fox, mm -hmm. my Michael J. Fox. He's on two two hour medication too. <laughs> And he's, he's taking pretty much the same medicine I'm taking. I'm taking some more, uh, some more different kind of medicine because I had some depression with, with the disease. Um, I don't know why depression goes with it, with Parkinson's, but it does. And uh, what happens is over time, it's, uh, Parkinson's is, is, is a sneaky disease. It sneaks up on you. You don't even know what's happening until so you get caught. And once you get caught, it's serious for life. 
Changed my life. Man, it, for the minute I tried it, I knew it was going to work. I don't know if you noticed when I turned it on. It's immediate. But the problem is, it's immediate off, too. So when I turn this thing off in four or five minutes, I'll be right back to where I was. That's pretty amazing. Um, do, do you want to turn it off and, and show how that how it goes back? No. No? <laughs> because it won't go back the whole way immediately. But over a course of about four or five minutes, I'm right back, back to the way I was. That's about how many employees. Three Was it was it here in, in Florida? Yeah, it was in Tampa. Okay. James, I forgot uh, you were diagnosed with Parkinson's when? 1998. 1998. And you have DBS. Yeah, two. But uh, bilateral. Um, when did you get that? Uh, One two, side first? Yeah, 2004. The right? And six months later. Very little daily with the breathing. Two. Oh, because I didn't want to. I wanted to tell you like we going to fix the problem. So, so I'll tell you, having used anything you do is beneficial. But if I had three things wrong, we would fix the problem. So, I'll be a combination. How old are you? Six. Six. Sixty. Six. Six. Have you, you lived in Florida all your life? No, I came here when I was sixth grade. Well, that's almost all your life, isn't it? <laughs> you have brothers or sisters? Two sisters. Are they living here as well? Yes. Where are you from originally? Alabama. Oh, yeah. I still have kind of a southern dialect. Yes. <laughs> Even having moved here all that time. Yeah. And do you have children? Two daughters. And where are they? They're both in Plant City. In Plant City. And um, grandchildren? Two grandchildren. Uh -huh. In Plant City. Yeah. So do you see them a lot? Yes. Uh -huh. Oh, too much. Too much. <laughs> do you? You babysit a lot? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Want to read again? Uh, those places. The blue sky is uh, on the key, key, key. How hard did he get it? We were away a year ago. Mm -hmm. We eggs every easy. My mama makes lemon puffins. Peter will keep in the peak. When sunlight strikes, rain dry up. In there, they act like a prison and form a rainbow. The rainbow is a division of white light in my beautiful color. The same shape of a long round arc with its patch high above and to the apparently beyond the the blue spot is on the key again. How hard did it hit him? We were away, away a year ago. We eat eggs every, every Easter. My mama makes lemon muffins. Peter will keep at the peak. Alright, well, read one last time. Read the rainbow passage. When sunlight strikes raindrops in the air, they act like a prism and form a rainbow. The rainbow is a division of white light into many beautiful colors. These take the shape of a long round arc with its path high above and its two ends apparently beyond the horizon. Well, that was clear, was loud and clear. What do you, what do you, 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 do you think of the party noise? I think this, this is better than the last one. Hear my own voice. 
I love it. You didn't like that. What, what kind of exercise do you, you like? You said you like. I uh, ride a bicycle. We walk out of the gym. Okay. And we take walks. Married to Florida? Uh, no, not at that. I, I live here, but not at that. You're still working? Uh, part time. What do you do? I'm an architect. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, and, and so when you're not here, where are you? In Honduras. Oh, so it's not I spend some time over there, some time over. Interesting. And so do you have a business in Honduras? Ah, uh, yes, I still have it. And what type of um, business do you do? Like commercial or residential? Uh, mostly residential. Really? Mostly. But I do a little bit of uh, both. Was there a lot of building going on right now? No, 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 no. Oh, okay. No. Yeah. Well, that's good. Yeah. Well, thank you for coming in. Thank you. 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 Well, so, sometimes in the morning, it's very clear. Mm -hmm. uh, as, as the day and the hour pass, it, it, it's coming down. It gets less so. And, and then uh, sometimes uh, I very have dif difficulties, difficulties to, 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 to talk. Uh, to think of the words or just... Both, both. Think of the words. And also, uh, I have a hard time sometimes to, to get started. Just the cleric, get started. Get started. Okay. And, and, and sometimes I. Yep. Okay. Please read the following sentence. The blue spot is on the key again. How hard did he hit him? We were away a year ago. We can eat eggs every Easter. My mom makes lemon muffins. Peter will help to keep the, the, the big. The, the blue spot is on the key again. How hard did he hit him? We were away a year ago. We eat eggs every Easter. My mom makes lemon muffins. Peter will keep at the big. Please read the following sentence. The blue spot is on the key again. How hard did it hit him? We were away a year ago. We eat eggs every Easter. My mom makes lemon muffins. Peter will keep at the big. When you met her, did she speak Spanish? No, no, no. 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 So she's learned over all she the years. She's living in Honduras 22 years oh, now. Wow. And she got married when she was 20. Wow. Yeah. So were all of your children born there? No, no they, they were born in Honduras. Uh -huh, in Honduras. But one of them lives now in Dallas, Texas. Uh -huh. He's an electrical engineer. Uh -huh. He has uh, three children. Nice. And the other son is an architect living in Honduras. Okay. He's taking care of my, of my office. Uh-huh, uh-huh. She's been in Honduras how long? 22 years. 23? Yeah. Who? Oh. No, Karen, my wife. Yeah. Karen. She came here in 1970. So, 22 years. Uh, he sounds great. I think this yeah, is, to me, yeah. this really is really as... I don't, I, 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 I can't say that I agree with his math, so... <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... so 1970, it, 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 more like 40, 43 years. 